You don't seem all that hung up about Carol. Carol's Carol, I guess. Still has to do things her way. She hasn't changed at all. Not in the way you did, right? What's that supposed to mean? Just saying. You can't blame your friends for not growing up as fast as you. Oh yeah. Like you gave me a choice. And you're still holding on to that. You stole me from my family before I was even hatched. So yeah. Yeah, I'm going to hold on to that. Listen, I was a kid. A kid who needed to get in good with the scarves. I'm sorry that I picked your egg, but that's how it was. We're lucky that I even found my way back. Lucky? Lucky that I never got to know my parents? Lucky that I discovered I was a living trophy? They wanted the egg for the pool room. It was luck... It was good that they didn't mind when you hatched. Things could have gone a whole lot worse. I have a criminal record from being raised by a bunch of thieves, Spade. I lived in the woods because my wanted posters were everywhere. What do you want me to say? I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry that your life didn't turn out the way it was supposed to. I made some bad decisions, brought you along for the ride, and now we're here, okay? It's not okay. And I'm sorry about that too. This is why we don't talk. Ha! Carol one, short stuff and snake guy zero. Good hustle out there. Got the old adrenaline pumping with that massive pileup. And we won ourselves a prize for all our trouble. We make a pretty good team, huh? Yeah, kind of like old times, only with way more giant robot shenanigans. So, why don't we keep doing this? You know, make this partnership thing a little more long-term. Um, I'm flattered, but you're not really my type, Spade. I'm talking about rejoining the Red Scarves, dummy. You're still wearing the colors, even. Oh, yeah, nah. The thing about organized crime is it's organized crime. I'd be happy to never see my face on a wanted poster ever again. Besides... Lilac would kill me. But Lilac isn't here right now. None of your so-called friends are. <sighs> Look, I wouldn't be here if they understood my sister the way I do. And I can't blame them for not wanting to trust her. She's doing this thing with Merga for a reason, and I'm going to find out why. Even if I have to do it with face punchies. <laughs> Always with the face punchies. It's what a Carol does best.